I went to the store yesterday, which you guys saw, you went with me, it was last week's video, and I was gonna get sugar-free creamer or fat-free half and half, but then I saw this, and I just had to get it. Some things are worth the extra calories, and this might be one of them. The other one was berries and cream, very delicious. I have high hopes for this. It's the Bridgerton series of International Delight. You can't not get it, right? We gotta have some joy in our life, but I am gonna be a good girl in my now, because we're not trying to do shots of vodka. <laughs> I'm not trying to do that. I've done that many times. Probably another reason I was 300 pounds. If you're new here, my name's Stevie. I post health and wellness content, what I eat in the days. We go to the gym together because we're gym besties. I can't open this. Okay, don't get mad at me. I, I know, I'm not supposed to do that. I can hear my mother all the way from here. I know. Okay? You don't have to lecture me. We're gonna do, now listen, 15 milligrams is 35 calories. This stuff, heavy hitter. Heavy hitter, be very careful, very, very careful. We're gonna do, since we're not on the shred yet, so 30 milligrams. Oh, I already went over, dang it, we did 36 milligrams. 30 milligrams, it looks like. Girl, you probably been adding like hundreds of calories to your coffee if you do the <laughs> right? That's not a lot. Can you believe that's 65 calories? No, 70 calories, this is 70 calories. Nuts. That's why you gotta be careful. That's why you gotta weigh it out. We got the coffee. We don't got the weigh the coffee. It's zero calories. At least. Right? I'm sure there's some hidden calories in there somewhere. Oh yeah. That's a big cup. Let's try it. Hot. You know, I don't taste it that much. Maybe it's not worth the calories. Oops. Simon, what are you chewing up? Simon, no. Oh no. Bad boy. Here, eat this. Oh, that was a waste of footage. Today is Sunday, the last day before the shred begins. And it's very nice outside. It's gonna be like 86 today. I don't know, we went from winter to summer real quick. I'm eating a mamba. Don't worry, I'll track it. It's blueberry. Mm. Mambas are so much better than Starburst. I don't care who hears it. How does Starburst get to that level of like popularity when they are nasty compared to Mamba's. I have no clue. Simon and I went finishing. I didn't film it because I didn't feel like it. I'm sorry. I'll take you next time maybe. But we haven't eaten today and we're gonna have a brunch. So this is what's for brunch. We got a hash brown and two sourdoughs. And you know how I said, once the sourdough is gone, we're gonna go back on a calorie deficit. It's gone. This is the last of it. Some eggs and some sausages, And that's lunch slash breakfast, also known as bar brunch. Guys, I'm doing the thing again that I forgot I was vlogging. So, I mowed the grass. Now I'm in my camper getting it ready for the season. I did have carpet on the top, but uh, it gets so hot in here in the summer that I have not been able to find an adhesive that sticks. It kind of just falls off, which is a bummer, but whatever. But if you guys didn't know, I actually have a camping channel. Um, I don't post on it very, very regularly. It's my dream to be a full-time camping YouTuber. That'd be amazing. I, it's just on hold right now, but if you're interested, I'll link it down below. But anyway, last year, I could not sit up in my truck camper at all. I was like, it was not, we were, we weren't even close. Like it was just something I like had a slouch like, like this, uh, like in between my legs, like crouch, you know, like squat kind of thing. Wow. There's no way to do that elegantly. Also, I know I don't have sunscreen rubbed in all the way on my head. Just deal with it. Okay. Safety first. I'm very hot and sweaty, but now I can sit up because we have lost inches on our booty. That is proof that we are going in the right direction. Undeniable proof that has nothing to do with the scale is I'm sitting in, in my oasis, my Midwest oasis. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most mis Midwestern thing I think I've ever said. It's also pretty true. But anyway, uh, I just wanted to share that. It's very hot in here right now. I don't have any windows open. I do have the door open. I do love my truck camper. I think a camping sash is in order. 
I camp. I want to camp by myself. I just like doing stuff by myself. And like, I usually take Simon with me or, okay. I try to take Butch, but every single time it gets dark out, he's like, no, I'd rather go sleep in my bed. And he whines and won't stop whining. The worst whine. He is, he's a couch potato and he is, he just doesn't like to rough it. Simon, on the other hand, is just like all about it. So Simon, my solo camping buddy. Um, But I like to solo camp. This is my solo camping setup. Now you're saying, but what if Caitlin wants to go? Listen, this part slides out super easily and then underneath my feet there's a board that you just pops up and then I have the extra bedding um, in the garage. You just put that down and bam, you have like a full size bed in here. And I have another shelf for storage I can pop in if I really wanted to. So I'm very proud of this. <laughs> Camper, this is like my pride and joy, and I know it's not much, but I love it so much. Oh my gosh, I'm blowing up like a balloon because I'm so hot. A recipe for disaster for most people because they eat super low, and their intention is to eat low on the weekdays. The first day of the shred is upon us. I just got home from work. That's a lie. I just got home from Tarche. Now, I am out of BCAAs. I do feel like they help with my muscle soreness, plus with energy as well. And I have like only one more serving of blooms. So I'm gonna try the strawberry kiwi. I bought that today. And then this is what Target had for BCAAs. So hopefully these go together. And then I bought things to make chicken enchiladas this week. We didn't have the sauce or the green chilies. But so far, so good. I am right where I need to be with my macros. We're gonna have a mushroom chicken pasta tonight. You're like, Stevie, you're eating pasta on a diet? Yeah, I'm eating pasta on a diet. If I can't eat pasta, then that diet's not for me. And I also think this is interesting because, um, so I'm using a uh, macro factor and some of you have asked questions about it, like if I like it or not. And I do, I'm gonna, just, um, we're gonna put it on airplane, no. I do like it, so here's today, and there's a dashboard, and you can see I have zero calories remaining, um, and I have, how much left? You can flip over, or no, you can like do consumed. So I have 174 grams of protein, so I didn't hit my protein quite to like on top of it today, but I was really close. I'm under my fat, but over my carbs. And that's probably why I missed my protein. And then, and oh my gosh, I am so sorry about the Instagram. Ah, I'm popular. So then it like has my trending weight and it also tracks, like I weigh every day, almost every day right now, just to put data in this app uh, because it adjusts my calories for me based on my goals and based on like my food log and how much I'm eating. So this week it actually dropped my calories down 100 calories to 2022, which uh, coincidentally is right where Nicole has me as well. I think she has me at 26 or 36, very, very close. And then like you can go down and it's super in depth and you can customize all this. Um, and you can see like by month, by year, whatever you want to do. And then like the actual food log, it goes by hour. So it's not like meal, but if you want the like empty hours to disappear, you can push that button and then the empty, the hours disappear, like the empty hours disappear. So this has been like super helpful. It's super easy to uh, log food. So all you gotta do to log food is there's a little bar uh, code Wait, you guys, I'm recording this. There's a barcode scanner. You just click that and then you just uh, can scan the barcode. And then if it doesn't have the barcode in the system, then you can actually scan the label. Oh, and I'm sorry for the dog hair. I bought a dog shedding brush and combed Simon outside and then put that brush in the bag like a, like a smart person that I am. But you can scan the label. Usually it's faster than this, um, but I think it's just because there's so much on the label. Like it's filling in slowly. There's just a lot of text on this. It's usually like super fast, but then you can add it. So then later um, it pops up for you. And that's like the one thing I absolutely love about this app is that um, 
<laughs> it has that label scanner and I never have to search for anything. I just go click, 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 click on all the food that I'm eating and it's super easy. It's also super easy to change. I'm sorry about the dogs. Hey, it's also super easy to change the serving. Like it's all right there. I'm liking it better than my fitness pal currently. I'll check back to you guys and I'm gonna reach out to the company and see if I can get you guys a discount code cause that'd be pretty cool. It's a newer app. So I think that might be doable. I might be at that status, probably not, let's be honest. But I'm gonna try because so far I'm really, really liking this app and I would love for you guys to get a discount if you'd like to try it. It's also cheaper month to month than MyFitnessPal. So I will link it down below. It, I also put a whole Fairlife shake in here because I forgot mine at school and the only ones I have here are hot. It's actually better than I thought it would be. And Fairlife is straight up chocolate milk. I'm telling you, it's great. Mm, mm, mm. All right, I'm sorry. I started eating before I showed you guys. This is a mushroom and chicken creamy pasta. It's kind of like, like a stroganoff almost. It has sour cream and Parmesan in it. It's really good. It was super easy to make too. I'll um, put the recipe down below. I substituted like full fat sour cream to like, you know, low fat. And I don't know, I think that's, oh, and uh, it calls for whole wheat pasta and I use the chickpea pasta for extra calories or extra protein. But for this plate, it's 388 calories, 32 grams of protein, 15 fat and 35 carbs. That's not too bad. I think I'm gonna add maybe a half of a serving more because um, I have more calories. Tuesday morning. My new pre-workout, or not pre-workout, my new BCAAs are in there, and now it's an interesting color. But bottoms up, here we go. I'm nervous, I'm real nervous for this. <sighs> I can do this. Okay, that's not, that's not horrible. I think that's actually better than the other flavor, maybe. Close, we did it. Weighed myself this morning. I'm still holding strong at 293. No drops yet but I am confident we're gonna see 292 this week, minimum. Love to see 291, but 292 for sure. Oh, I'm so tired. After work, I went to get my MRI. Also, you should be proud of me. The clothes behind me are folded and I just need to put them away, but they're completely folded and that means a lot to me. I did, I did that. I'm proud of myself. Growth mindset. Don't look at the rest of the room though. We're getting there. Okay, this room is my Achilles heel. But anyway, so I finally got my MRI done and I got the results. I don't know what the results mean. I mean, like, of course I Googled it, but it's Google. So I have a cyst, a large cyst underneath my kneecap. That's fun. And according to Google, they usually drain it or shoot steroids into it um so it also said that if they drain it it will come back even if you have it surgically removed apparently there's a possibility that it will come back and having them surgically removed is like a rare thing i guess so i think this is the cyst and i we we're stuck together we're gonna be besties i'm gonna make the best out of the situation i feel a little like my big fat greek wedding right now and you know i have a lump in my knee and you know she might be my twin sister we don't know yet but if you know it is what should we name her <laughs> okay i'm cracking myself up i gotta stop so my camera is gonna die so I have to wrap this up I really hope you like today's vlog I enjoyed making it I am sorry that I forgot about dinner dinner was a chicken burger I have about 200 calories left for the day gonna finish with a protein bar and we got the protein up we're doing really good on the shred so far this is day two it's Tuesday but if you could hit that like button helps my channel out immensely but until next time friends be kind to yourself bye oh and subscribe